One of the worst things a pet can go through is being abandoned by its owners. People sometimes let their dog out and leave them in unfamiliar places because of various reasons. Most times, it's because they cannot take care of them anymore. Instead of letting them out and abandoning them out of the blue, people should drop them off at animal shelters or let someone else adopt them and take care of them. Dogs are the most loyal animals on the planet. They are more loyal than humans can ever be and will always be there for you no matter what. They, or any other pet for that matter, do not deserve to be abandoned. Leaving them alone can result in a lot of mental health issues other than just the physical dangers that come with walking around in a strange place without an owner. One person who is very familiar with such scenes is Pippa Jackson. She is the founder of and executive director of Animal Rescue Fund of Mississippi, or ARF, ARF, one of the state's largest no-kill animal shelters. The shelter was founded in 2005 with the aim of providing help to countless animals that were affected by Hurricane Katrina. Now, they rescue pets that are either abandoned by their masters or are ill-treated, taking them in and providing them with justice and a new home. At the shelter, the animals are provided with a lot of personal attention. They are given medical care whenever needed, and the organization even helps them work on their social skills. It provides a home to not just dogs, but even cats, providing them all with a safe and happy environment to live and grow in. People are allowed to adopt new pets from here as well. Pippa Jackson is known in her circles to be an animal lover and does everything she can to protect these pets. But recently, there was one particular dog that had kept her up for nights. It's got to be horrible for the dog. The utter despair it must feel. A young pup was recently left outside of the shelter's entrance by an individual. This is something that the organization is used to. They see this happen on a regular basis. Most time, pets are left outside the entrance in a box or in their carrier for the staff, or Jackson herself has to come and pick them up. Things were a little different this time, as a dog was not placed, but pushed out of the car and left in the parking lot resulting in the dog frantically chasing after the owner's car, which could potentially injure the pup. Jackson was made aware of this horrible event only after she saw the footage on the security camera while she was looking up the footage in hopes to find information on two different abandoned dogs that were both left at the shelter's gate shivering and crammed into a carrier too small to comfortably hold both pets. Jackson has been working at the animal shelter for around 14 years now, and says that she's very understanding of people when they come to the shelter to leave their pets. They have their own reasons. During an interview with People, she said, We're not here to chastise people. Life happens. We don't want to make a difficult decision more difficult. They normally just take the animals in and provide them a home, instead of questioning the owners who clearly don't want to or cannot be owners to their pets anymore. This case is very different from every other one that she's come across in her time at the shelter. What she found most surprising was the lack of regard the owner had for the safety of the dog. According to Jackson, the full footage showed the person with the dog parking at the shelter during business hours and walking up to the front door. Instead of knocking at the door and speaking with one of the staff, the person returned to the car and pushed their dog out and drove away. They almost ran over the dog when they were backing out, Jackson said. She explained that the person even had the option of placing the dog in one of the crates or pens that are kept outside of the shelter, instead of leaving the pup out in the open. There is no way the driver didn't see them, she added. After seeing the owner drive off, the dog ran around between the shelter and the street outside for a while, until finally disappearing from view. The dog is apparently still missing. Jackson and her team have been looking for the dog effortlessly ever since they saw the footage. Volunteers who are looking for the missing pup increase their search radius by one mile every single day the dog remains missing. They even set up humane traps in the woods in case the dog's hiding out there. When dogs are discarded, they generally stay in the same area waiting for their owners to come back, Jackson said. But this dog appears to be young and may not have those survival skills. Jackson hopes that the increased news coverage helps the shelter finally find the missing dog and provide the pup with a loving home that it needs and deserves. She also suggests that people who are planning on giving up their pets should consider talking to a no-kill shelter in the area. According to her, many shelters, like her own, will help owners with pet food and medical costs, or, if necessary, help find animals new homes. 
She ended the interview saying, that's the business we're in, the business of help. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and consider sharing it with your friends and family. Thanks again, and we'll see you in the next one.